Let's face it, stepping into a classroom again after a few decades away can be a bit intimidating. Just ask Linda Gonzalez, a cell operator at Pratt & Whitney. Well, I think it's scary in a sense if you've been out of school for a long time. And they're telling you you're going to be learning a lot of new things, everything that you haven't worked with in years. So you kind of shy away from it. How quickly those butterflies fly away after completing a five-week inspection, quality, and technical drawings training program at Connecticut's Goodwin College. The Pratt & Whitney supported curriculum is another example of the partnership between the company and Goodwin, aimed at increasing valuable skill sets of current employees. The company recently launched a program with York County Community College in Maine for its North Berwick manufacturing employees. Pratt Whitney also has a manufacturing training program in place with Asnuntuck Community College located in Enfield, Connecticut. These programs are critical as the company begins its production ramp. This program was set up specifically for quality and quality management and the skills that are needed for quality management including metrology and calibration, geometric tolerancing, and some math skills that help employees to do well in manufacturing. I taught mathematics and I said, what's important here for you, I'm not going to use calculators in the course, and everybody got a little nervous about that. I said, I want you to learn the principles of math and be able to walk out of here with an understanding. Maybe you can't solve every problem in the future, but I want you to understand the concept of math. Numbers? Indeed, lots of numbers, but the trepidation students feel about reading blueprints or attacking a math problem consistently gets subtracted with the addition of confidence. So I looked at a blueprint for uh, in parts in Pratt & Whitney a few months ago, and I couldn't believe I didn't know anything on there. I was like, wait a minute, I know how to read blueprints. Well, why can't I read this? Well, now I can honestly say, might not be an expert but I know how to look at that blueprint right now. And I'm excited about it. The most important part was they really liked the hands-on experience. They liked uh, using their hands to actually measure parts, taking a part like this, measuring it, comparing it to a blueprint, measuring it with different types of equipment, uh, certainly helped them to get a really good hands-on experience. After five weeks, the classroom doesn't look so intimidating. It's welcoming and Linda, as well as her colleagues, return to Pratt & Whitney excited about what they have to offer. I think people should take what's inside them and, and give it a try, and I think the way this is put together, it helped a lot. 